Here I am in front of this huge stand of sea hibiscus, also known as coastal cottonwood. And it's growing in the wild here, and I'm going to steal, I mean I'm going to harvest one seed pod. And there aren't too many flowers left because it's getting towards the end of the season. And I'm going to take the seed pot home and grow the seeds. I am going to be using the moist paper towel method to germinate the seeds. Because the hull is quite hard, the seeds first need to be scarified, which means that a small segment of the seed hull needs to be cut off to allow moisture to penetrate to the seed inside. My tool of choice is a large nail clipper, though rough sandpaper also works well. Just expose a small bit of white, being careful not to injure the seeds itself. I did not soak these seeds. Place your scarified seeds in a waterproof container or a plastic Ziploc freezer bag with your moistened paper towel. I prefer a container as I think it gives the seeds a bit more room to germinate. Leave your seeds out of direct sun and keep above 75 degrees Fahrenheit, about 25 degrees Celsius. Here they are after nine days. Almost every seed germinated. Excellent. I am going to transfer all of them into a container with regular potting soil. In retrospect, I believe it would have been better to leave them in the moist paper towel container a bit longer to allow the seedlings to grow a bit larger and stronger before transplanting. To protect your seedlings from bugs and insects and to maintain a high humidity content, you may wish to place them in a sealed bag or place a bag over the top. It's been one month now and our seedlings are looking pretty good. You can see some of the first true leaves. In retrospect, I probably should have left them in the moist paper towel container a bit longer to grow a bit stronger. I'm thinking an even higher percentage would have survived. Let me know in the comments below how it went for you or if you used a different germination method. I look forward to having hibiscus flowers in my garden. You know, I don't do merch, I don't have sponsors, and I don't push products. But simply by watching one more video from one of these links, you can truly support my independent YouTube channel. Thanks so much, take care, and be well.